Hi, I'm Phil Nuttall, Managing Director of the Cruise Village. I'm a TTG roving reporter and I'm joined by Travel TV as we take a Viking River cruise down the Danube. And we're going to sample some of the finest cities that it has to offer. My job is to highlight the key selling points of a Viking River cruise to make it easier for you to sell river cruising. So come and join me on board and we'll find out more what this wonderful ship, the Prima Donna, has to offer. Well, here we are at breakfast on the Viking Prima Donna. And if you were worried you weren't sure what you were going to be able to eat, then don't. They've got breakfast cereals, dried fruit. They've even got healthy options, fresh fruit, yogurts, and for those who like a full hearty breakfast, they do bacon and eggs, right down to pastries and continental style meats. In fact, there's such a wide choice, I don't really know where to start. But one thing you do get on a Viking River cruise at breakfast that you can't buy at home is the scenery. I'm going to give you a quick tour now of the cabins you'll find on a Viking river cruise ship. Uh, this cabin that we're in at the moment is uh, an A-grade deluxe suite. It's a large cabin, um, it has uh, a large bathroom, very much similar size, the bathrooms, to what you'd find on uh, the modern cruise liners. There's, there's no great difference there. Um, what you will find in this cabin, though, with it being an A-grade deluxe suite, is it's got a large veranda, big picture window, and you get outside, sit on your own private balcony. Uh, there's plenty of wardrobe space as well. Uh, the double beds, they convert into queen beds, you've got your own television, there's a mini bar. In fact, everything you'd ever need really from a cabin on a river cruise ship. Food on board a Viking River Cruise is excellent. There's something for everybody's palate, so bon appetit. Ich glaube, es gibt sogar noch einen dritten. Ja, ja. Ich würde